Oh, chicken! Ah, <laughs> what? <laughs> I almost, uh, I almost split my car <laughs> because of this chicken. Oh my god! Well, hello everyone. Thank you so much for joining me in this game, and we are back, of course, in Mist Survivor. And this is gonna be season four, day one. And for day one, our main goal it is to find as many backpack upgrades that we can on day one, and of course to upgrade our car and for that we're gonna need of course four tire an engine and the batteries and if you're new to this game you need to know that when it comes to your inventory this is all that you get so to upgrade all these slots you need to find as many backpack upgrades that you can and this is kind of the most important things to do and luckily for me i am exactly where i want to be so if i look at the map we are currently right over here and we are just gonna get on this sawmill area because over here we're gonna find two backpack upgrade so yeah let's just get started straight away and the first things you kind of want to check it is this house over here inside we're gonna find one skeleton you do want to check always these skeletons because always they get some great stuff on look at that this is just getting amazing so far Anyway, just cross over this little hill over here. We are gonna find the first backpack upgrade right over here. Oh, of course there is one teddy bear over there. Hmm, I totally missed that part. Uh, but I should be okay. We just go on this side. And the first backpack upgrade is gonna be inside this toilet. Very, very, it is over there. No big deal at all. Open the door and voila, the first one, it is over here, again, current location on the map, right over here. The next backpack, it is basically crossover, we just need to cross this little hill to the other side, and this is where we are gonna find the next one. Basically, it's gonna be on the back, right over here, look at that, the second backpack upgrade. Again, on the map, current location, it is right over here on this sawmill area. And well, we are already over here, so let's just check this place really quickly. Obviously, I'm gonna leave a lot of loot behind. The only things that I do want it, it is one, these cabinets. Check this really quickly, some more ammunition, what I needed. Okay, and we can put what I don't need it inside. Check if we do have more ammo. Of course, some components. I can take that. More components, some scrap. What do we have here? All right, some more bullets and of course a t-shirt. Nice. Pick up that one. Nothing too crazy. Oh, this one, it's fake one, yes. Um, basically, basically, we are ready to go. I just need to pick up this one and you can run with these cabinets all over the place. No big deal. And we are basically moving on to our third location for backpack upgrade. And that one, it's gonna be a little bit more special because we are gonna get a free slots upgrade. Basically, we are moving to that tunnel that is in the front of me. And just like I say, the third one, it's gonna be inside this tunnel. Uh, stay over there, okay. Just kinda want to go on the back. You can get inside. Of course, we are gonna find also one skeleton. It is all, oh, oh, uh, some infected. I did totally miss that part. <laughs> okay. Some infected, obviously they cannot really run outside because obviously they can burn to the death. But there is something that you need to know about this infected. They are not really very smart. And the other things, well, they cannot use stairs, okay? They can go down, but they cannot go up. So we are pretty much safe right now over here. Can grab some more scrap. Some 
some components and of course another skeleton is gonna be right over here look at that and of course west armor and a baseball bat yeah why not take this close equip this one and a west armor of course i don't have a pants even I, if i do see something but blue now obviously the backpack upgrade it is basically on the other side uh, just like i said in fact they cannot go on the top they cannot use the stairs they can go down there is one effect that over there but probably we can avoid that one without any problem just need to cross to the other side i should be safe over here look at that just like i did say they cannot go on the top okay so you are 100 safe over here i just need to attract that one somehow uh to climb on the, on the outside come on and he's not very smart he he's already down there and we are 100 oh no oh okay okay he is smart let's try to attract him get out of here I should be safe right now and uh, I'm pretty damn sure that he is down okay he's still on the top okay it does seem stuck for me but uh, yeah I should be safe over here I hoping it's not follow me all right and here is the backpack upgrade free slots upgrade again if you're looking on the map current location for this one it is right over here now i just need to get out of here yeah it's, it might be some problem but i can probably run it does seems yeah we are pretty much 100 percent safe and we are done with this place i did get what i wanted and obviously the, when it comes to the car we do need four tire and engine and the batteries and when it comes to the tire and engine you cannot put in your inventory and for that the best things to do it is basically use a cart uh, obviously you can craft a cart by yourself or you can get this one that is already fertile and you can also put this on the cart why not like so boom obviously if you need a cart for the location itself current location it is right over here and i do have basically everything we needed i did totally forget to check this box in the first place oh chocolate yes nice anyway the next things we are heading over this military outpost over here because obviously right in this military outpost we are gonna find two backpack upgrades also an engine and a gas gun and we are gonna need a gas gun to get ourselves a batteries and of course this is kind of the best place to loot in the early days because oh obviously over there we are gonna find a lot of weapon a lot of ammunition basically everything what we need uh, but first things first let's just check this general store and there is something that you need to know first things always look around okay and if you do came across for example this wooden box this one You just need to use this box just to get yourself on the roof. Reason why I do want to get on the roof? It is pretty simple. Look at that. Another backward upgrade, another skeleton, and one bow just disappeared. Another machete for the location of course it is right over here and while we are here we can also loot this place do want to check this location pretty soon and yes 
first tire. It's gonna take 10 minutes, so let's take this out and put this on my cart. At this point I only need 3 more tires. More components, okay. Oh, some pens, just what I needed. So what do we have over here? Not really too much, some salt. Alright, pick up this one. Nothing inside in toilets, okay. Some sugar, why not? Oh! Some coins, just what I needed to drink one cola. So, we are gonna also find some more cabinets on the top. Uh, we're just gonna take probably one with me. We can probably also look this place really quickly. Obviously, I don't have really much whole bunch of space on me, but more bullets. Okay. Take these bullets out and let's just put all the stuff that I kind of don't really need it. Like so. Take this out and uh, we should be okay at this point. Take, check this place really quickly. One more pistol, of course. Cool. Maybe something more in the backyard. Okay, some arrow. More bottles, I don't care about bottles at this point. Baseball key. And boom, we can move on. So basically on our left it is a gas station. This is where we are gonna find a red truck. And this is what I am gonna repair at some point. Uh, so here is uh, where you are gonna find a red truck. And as you may see there is always one tire over here. So you just gonna need to find three more tire. So I do need only two more to find, we can check this place really quickly. Uh, there's more coins of course, some, for some more cola. And look at that, M4, just like inside in toilets. Hmm. This day is just getting better and better. And more bullets. Should I take this so why not? And of course more bullets. So we are basically heading to the Paradise Hotels. Now you probably do want to avoid these Paradise Hotels at least in early days because uh, there is a whole bunch of infected inside. Now the great uh, things about this place it is that probably you're gonna find some more tires. And also, right over here, we are gonna find one more backpack upgrades. Just looking for some more tires. Park over here uh, should be more than okay. Check this police car. One more pistol. And of course we do have one extra tire. Take this out. It's gonna take only 10 minutes. So basically at this point I just need to find one more tire. Of course an engine. And a battery. Put this over here. And there is one more missing tire. And just like I did say before, always check the surrounding area. Because if you do find some uh, wooden box just like this one, you can use this box to get on the roof. And there is always a reason to get on the roof. If there is a wooden box nearby, there is a reason. If not, there is nothing on the roof. But in this case, just look at that. Another backpack upgrade. Right over here, skeleton. Right over here, and of course, AK-47. And 
And this day is just getting better and better. Uh, basically we did find so far many 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 weapons, some bullets and of course mist is coming out which is not super great. Uh, now we are basically hmm, pretty much safety area because we are on the roof. Uh, so we should be okay. Now when it comes to the mist you need to know that mist can last something like one hour or even like four hours or more. The best way to do it is kinda sleep. So I'm just gonna sleep for one hour for now. It's still mist, okay, let's sleep for another one hour. And the mist it is almost over. I just need to wait that, that one it is burning to hell. And the mist is over. He's burning, so the mist is over. We can go down. Oops. I did hear somebody. Oh. Doesn't feel like that you are okay, amigo. Anyway, we do have what we needed. We just need to check that uh, military outpost. Now, obviously on our left there is one bandit camp, so we kinda do want to avoid this bandit camp, so we are gonna take these shortcuts. And while we are here, we can also check this area really quickly. So what do we have here? More components. Okay, there is a single shot shotgun inside. I don't care about bottles anymore. What do we have here? Nothing. Okay. Something on the top. Yeah. Probably I should take one more cabinet, so why not? So let's just get back to the road. We need to get to that military outpost. Basically for that military outpost you kinda need to follow this uh, road basically and you will get over there and you will always find an engine over there and a gas can over there. And just like I did say before you will need a gas can to find a battery. And this is obviously one of the best places that you can loot early in the days. Uh, there is no dangerous at all in this place. You will just gonna find a whole bunch of weapons, a lot of ammunition and just like I did say already before, two backpack upgrades. So, let's just park over here. Oh, uh, probably better on the road, yeah, this is kinda more safety. Uh, so the first things first, the backpack upgrade it is of course inside this container. Uh, for that you basically need to start this generator that uh, obviously does run with gasoline. And first things first, we do need a gas can that we are gonna find right over here. And here it is, look at that, a gas can just what I needed. Pick one, this one, I do need to save a little bit my stamina. And reload this baby out. Obviously the first things, we do have an engine right inside this car. Always you're gonna find engine inside this car. Obviously it does take 45 minutes and we can put engine on my cart. It should stay over here. Oh, no, come on. Stay over there or I right, finally. Uh, the next things obviously we do need some gas. So pick up this one. Fill the gas can. We need to fill up this generator. 3% it should be more than okay. Come on, pick up this one. Start generator. You need to take this cart over here. And just like so. Open the door and look at that, another backpack upgrade. So this is basically the first one and of course a helmet inside. And look at that, more ammunition.
There is basically a whole bunch of uh, great stuff inside over here. Uh, we do have also this container that we do need to use a power, so can I take everything out? Do have ooh, Glock pistol. Amazing. I mean, this day it is basically just getting better and better. Do I have a t-shirt? That seems to yes. Anyway, let's put this outside. I kind of don't really live over here obviously we do have more food some more extra medical kits and basically we are more or less ready to go to our next location uh, first things we do need some extra space now uh, obviously the next uh, backpack upgrade it's gonna be on the top of this tower so before you climb on the top you, you need to save your game because climbing on the top of this tower, they can be really deadly. Because sometimes you can kind of fall off. Uh, obviously, it is some kind of bug, so you need to keep that in mind. Before you climb on the top, always save your game. And look at that, the second backpack upgrade, obviously on the map. We are currently on this military outpost where you will find two backpack upgrades, an engine and a gas can. And just like I did say before, you will need a gas can for a batteries. The next things we are gonna check, it is this uh, container over here, because inside we are gonna find a lot of weapon. And in my opinion, the best shotgun in the game. Double barrel shotgun, so yeah. It is definitely better that single barrel. There is one infected inside, but just like I did say before, they cannot use such stairs. Okay, so you should be safe over here. <laughs> Boom, and he's done. One pants, all right, cool. We do have one this military box. Obviously, we're gonna take this one. Just kind of want to throw outside. At some point, I will come back for all this stuff. More M4, which isn't really so bad. So I kind of want to throw all these cabinets outside. What do we have here? Okay. More cabinets. Right over there. And why not? We should throw also these beds. Some point I can use it. Boom. Ah, this is gonna stay right over there. Let's check this place really quickly. Oh, some boots. Just what I needed. Pick this one and alright, we do have finally everything we needed. Why did Totor forget to check this box? Nothing. Okay. Probably there is something on the top so I can check this one really quickly. Uh, okay, I think so. Okay. And I did Totor forget to check this one. Alright. Uh, but yeah, anyway, just look at that, how many, um, the amount of weapon that we did find so far, it is crazy. And all this basically on day one, which is super fantastic. But anyway, at this point we just need a battery, and we are gonna find battery basically at the gas station at the Paradise Hotel. So this is exactly where we are moving right now. Alright, so here we are, back at the gas station, and this is where we are gonna find our batteries. Now, the reason why I didn't take the battery early, because without uh, gasoline, you cannot. 
And the thing is, the battery it is basically inside, right over there. And for that you need to power up generator that is gonna be inside this gas station. Uh, first things first, there is one infected inside, we're gonna deal with that one. Oh, I... Okay. I... Come on. Oh, oh yes. She's down. We're sorry about you, but... Okay, you do have something. Ain't really so bad. Anyway, here is our generator. Of course, we do need to fill it up. I do have a little bit of gas. I'm hoping that it's gonna be enough. 1%, yes. It should be enough. Pick up this one. Start this generator. Open the door. And look at that. Here is our batteries. And a car jack. This is something that you definitely don't really want to leave behind. Because you will probably gonna use a car jack very often. Now that I am looking at this gas station. How cool it will be if we can turn this into our base. But obviously there is so much crap everywhere that it's kind of not really possible and of course it is raining and the other things very important you don't want to carry your batteries on you on the rain because otherwise you may lose it so first things first let's just install our batteries where is battery battery Here it is, okay. It's gonna take 10 minutes. Obviously we do need to install all four tire and the engine. So the only thing's missing. It is basically some gasoline inside and no, I did total wrong button. Just fill it up some gasoline and we are basically ready to go on the road. Alright, so this is this. Do have more enough, I can probably pick all these cabinets I can put on my truck, why not? Okay, I'm hoping that this is kind of safe, so before you drive, uh, there is one rule that you need to know. Always make a safety safe, okay? And we do have a couple of hours left before night, so let's just try to find some more backpack upgrades, why not? Okay, my truck, it does look super okay so far. And we are basically getting uh, near this gas station. We are gonna find two more backpack upgrade. Just need, uh, yeah, let's just take this road over here. And the first things that I am looking Definitely it's not this teddy bear. It is that yellow car over there. So this is where we are gonna find first backpack upgrade. Now oh, should be safe over here, so look inside and uh, here you go. So if you check on the map, the current location, here we are basically. And we are gonna get the second one, it is basically on the top, on that tower. And the easiest way, yeah, let's just, uh, let's just go over there. Climb on the top. And look at that, a helmet and a backpack upgrade. Ah, this is so nice. This day is just getting better and better. Look at that view. Uh, look at this my inventory basically we are almost uh, fully upgraded but we still have time to uh, find a couple more backpack upgrades why not and this is exactly what we are gonna do 
And we are a little bit on the run, so... Get out of this area in the first place. And obviously, yeah, why not? Let's just take this caravan. That way we can start working on our mobile base. Ready to dock? Okay. That seems uh, everything is sort of fine. Probably I should, I don't know, move a little bit like so. <laughs> okay. Uh, this is uh, this is uh, total normal. Eh? Um, nothing too crazy so far. <laughs> okay. Well, it does move. Uh, this is important, and we do have ourselves a mobile base, uh, which is uh, something that I do want it. I don't really want to flip this car, so let's just be a little bit careful over here. Uh, first things first, we are going to move it to our left, yes. We are going to take our first bed pack upgrade in this area and the other things we are gonna get a workbench this is something that you you need it but of course you can always build one or you can get yourself one for three and this is exactly where we are gonna find a workbench and a bed pack upgrade so it is quite a nice area let's just park over here so there is one teddy bear over there i do not like these teddy bears But I should be more or less okay, so yeah, it's right over there. There are two of them, Jesus. Anyway, we just need to climb on the top. And look at that, another skeleton, of course. Some great stuff. And uh, just what you needed. A backpack upgrade and of course for the location itself if you're looking for this backpack upgrade it is right over here in this hunting area. Anyway we are gonna get now ourselves a workbench. Obviously it, it is something that you can always build but it's kind of better if you can get yourself a workbench for free, why not? Just want to avoid this couple of teddy bears. And we do have something like one hour left. Maybe two hours left. Before night, so I, yeah, I think that we should be pretty much more or less okay. So let's just park, I don't know. Obviously this area, it is what it is. You can flip this uh, truck uh, quite easy. Uh, obviously what I'm looking for on the top. Uh, this is obviously one of the watchtowers that you can turn in your base. And yeah, remember what I did say about the fact that they cannot use stairs. So this base, for a starter base, it is pretty much them okay. It does come with generator. You can claim this base, it does uh, come with some storage inside, as you may see. And a workbench, a bed, basically you do have everything you need to start. But we are gonna take this one, why not? Uh, take some bullets. Hmm. I'm looking for some drink, but okay. Move over there. Please don't disappear. Uh, yes. We're gonna move this inside our camper. There should be more than enough space to move this inside. At least I hope so. Probably if I do place right over here somehow. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, Jesus Christ, how is this even possible? Move. Let's try one more time. Sometimes it, it does uh, seems like some kind of problem. Well, okay. Um, okay, let's put this on the back. Obviously, you can put it inside, but uh, it does seem like some problems sometimes. So we're gonna just put on the back. I think that it is pretty much safe if we drive like so. I do need something to drink really quickly. Or maybe we can also eat this one. Yeah, basically it is... Uh, yeah, okay, okay. Everything is total normal, so it's not a problem. Uh, we do have a couple of hours left before night. Basically not really a couple of hours if I do have lucky. Uh, we can probably even fully upgrade our inventory and the first back part upgrade basically is on the front of me uh, just kinda park over here Boom. and look at that back part upgrade of course the location for this one it is right over here uh, near this one, uh, you will find one more skeleton that is gonna be on the top, not really on the top, on the bottom. Kinda want to check this area. What do we have inside? And look at that, a long bow. This is the best bow that you will find all in the game. And of course, another skeleton. Look at that. Just what I needed. And we are basically ready to check out our next location basically for the last location because just what I needed one more backpack upgrade and we are done okay some seekers hmm I wasn't expected to find some seekers in the town But I'm not here for seekers. We are here basically for backpack upgrade and we are gonna find this one right over here. Look at that. Seekers does not see me, which is uh, super, super fantastic. Uh, let's take this out and boom. And why not another double barrel shotgun and look at my, and look at my inventory. Basically we did fully upgraded already entire inventory which is super fantastic everything on day one and why not we do have a couple of time left so we can probably visit some trader just to upgrade our car anyway uh, if you look for location for this uh, last uh, backward upgrade it is in this community area uh, just like I said we do have some extra time before night so we can probably drive over there. I'm hoping that we are not gonna flip our car right now. Just need to pass this block. But it's normally it's not really so easy. Oh, we do have lights. But I don't see nothing. And this lights even work. I don't know. I'm not sure at this point. So we need to pass this area. I don't know where is the safest area to pass. Okay. Oh, we are super, super okay. Oh, chicken. Ah, <laughs> what? I almost, uh, I almost split my car <laughs> because of this chicken. Oh my god! Enemies uh, number one for the road for my little red truck. I can't believe, I cannot believe that. And the bandits cap over my right side. They didn't see me. Oh, which is okay. Uh, but yeah, here we are at the trader outpost.
pretty damn night. I don't see nothing at all. Uh, but yeah, likely they have some light. So, uh, why not? We do need to park inside in the first place. Okay, now I do see lights. I don't know. Okay, everything is, just seems perfect for me. Hello, sir. Okay. You? Interact. I do need some parts. Bumper. So which one I do want? This one. Unlock this one. Okay. Unlock also this. Better lights. Why not? Uh, let's just change a paint. Uh, this is what I do want it. Turret defense. This is still not in the game. Uh, we do need to upgrade our trailer. Why not? Paint. Blue or red? Hmm. I don't know. Let's just make a blue. Unlock. Okay, leave and let's just make some upgrades. No. Confirm. And let's just upgrade our trailer. Battle Coral. And of course. Home farm. Anyway guys, I think that for day one, well, we did make so far Yeah, pretty much perfect uh, perfect start uh, Basically we did upgrade our trailer, our car We did find a workbench, we did fully upgrade our inventory slot Which is fantastic for the day one uh, But that being said, for this time around, I will just gonna end it up here So if you like what you see, smash that like button, leave some comments below and subscribe to the channel if you like. And thank you so much for the watching. And I will see you all on the next one. Hmm. It's better if I go sleep maybe inside.